Here's Mookie Betts. He'll get us going in the home half of inning number three. First delivery to him on the way. Line toward right center. And a high bounce will take it over the outfield wall, and he kicks off the inning with a ground rule double. Yeah, he was bowling around those bases and had every intention of stretching this into a triple. That is, until the ball hopped over the fence for a ground rule double. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Hard hit ball to second, and this is going to find the alley as he might have himself his second double of the ball game. And the run will score from second as we are once again tied three to three. Back to back doubles now, and that's a great way to get an inning going. The leadoff man shows him how it's done, and he comes right behind him following suit. Lacing a double of his own could be a big inning if this continues. And this is fouled back and out of play. Swing and there it goes. He got all of that ball. And out of here. And I mean by plenty. That ball was crushed. So it's a two-run shot to right center. Home run number nine on the year, and it's now five to three. Well, he won his last start, but he didn't give up any long balls. He's already given up two here, so he's got his work cut out for him if he's going to get the W on this one. He's going to have to start keeping the ball in the yard for starters. Here's the first baseman now, Mitch Moreland. 0 oh, for 1 baseman, for him here in this one. Mitch. Infield shifted well to the right. Here's the first pitch. Well hit the other way, and it's into the gap. Moreland around first on his way for two. And he gets in there standing. He's got himself a double. As a hitter, the only feeling better than hitting a bomb is driving one into the gap like that. He hustled out of the box knowing he was guaranteed a double, but I think he had thoughts of maybe a triple if the outfielder hadn't gotten it back in right away. Yeah, there really wasn't any question about that one going for extra bases off the bat. Here's Hanley Ramirez. Oh, my, this ball is crushed. Where will this one end up? It's a two-run shot for Hanley Ramirez. Number 21 for him on the season, as it is now 7-3. to three. I know he's a confident pitcher, but there's a difference between being confident and downright foolish. He just offered one of the most dangerous hitters in the lineup a straight heater, and it cost him big time. Now batting. Here's Jackie Bradley Center. now. Jackie Bradley Jr. Lined into left field, a base hit. Another first pitch hit. Man, they're going up there aggressive, looking for that first pitch fastball. He's struggling right now, and they are feasting. And now we see a right-hander up and throwing in the Angel bullpen. In now, Leroy Winnicka takes this the other way to right. And that'll get over the wall for a ground rule double. And that'll keep runners at second and third now with still nobody out. Well, he definitely puts a charge into this one. And the outfielder has zero chance to make a play on it. Next thing you know, the relievers in the pen have another ball to warm up with. Now here comes Angels manager Mike Sosha on his way to the mound. And he's going to motion for his bullpen here. That'll do Your it for the starter play. tonight. Ricky Nolasco is going to come on to pitch Number here. And in just the third inning, you have to think Ricky he'll be asked Nolasco. to eat some innings. That's in there. Base hit. In the score, the runner from third. And the second runner will stop at third. And they're at the corners now with nobody out. Well, we've always known this guy was a good hitter. You knew he was going to come out of it eventually. Here's another multi-hit game. It's not one hit that gets you out of it, but the multi-hit game. Maybe this is the signs of things to come.
Here's Xander Bogarts now. Hard liner towards short. Oh, and this nightmare inning continues as they're going to tack on even more here. And the runner from third crosses the plate. And the second run will score as well. Well, you look at his numbers, and there's no doubt he's faring much better against lefties, hitting better than 400 against them this season. And when you see swings like this, you can see why. Here's the first pitch to him. Hit hard to short. Played on the backhand. Throw bounces, but Pujols hangs with it. Nicely done. Third baseman, number 13. Here's Manny, Manny Machado, Machado now. He's got a couple of doubles thus far, so we'll see if he can keep it up. First pitch on its way. And he goes the other way, but he got a lot of it. Deep down the line. Gone. He finds the short porch for a home run. A two-run home run for Manny Machado, number 10 for him on the year, as they've pushed this lead up to nine now. Well, sometimes runs come in bunches, and that's definitely the case in this inning. That's three, count them, three home runs in this frame alone, four for the game. Did someone throw a home run derby they didn't tell me about? Sure looks that way. Short, hit hard. Escobar is there. In time to first, and there are two away. The first baseman, number 18. There's Mitch the first baseman now, Mitch Moreland. Moreland. One for two with a double on the ledger so far. A swing and a drive sent out toward the gap. Back goes Trout at the track. Out of here to the deepest part of the yard. Well, balls are flying out of here faster than they can throw them across the plate, it seems. That's four home runs in this inning alone. It's times like this when pitchers wonder if maybe they've chosen the wrong profession. Their pitching coaches start wondering too. Now Here's the left fielder, Hanley right, Ramirez. Hanley. A swing and a drive Ramirez. sent out toward the gap. And this is going to find the alley. Extra bases here for Ramirez. And he is in the second with a double, his third hit of the night. Here's Jackie Bradley now. Two base hits, both singles to this point. And now we'll take a moment here at home plate as he asks for time. He's set and the pitch. High fly ball out to straightaway center. Trout has a read on it. And that retires the side. But not before things change dramatically as they explode for 11 here to really open things up. On now to the top of inning number four. The Red Sox on top, 13 to three. Striding in once again, Danny Espinoza. He leads, leads off. 